Greetings and welcome to Factorio. I'm Degray and today we continue our entry level 2 megabase where we in the last episode just got a ton of our oil refining setup up and running. So we now have about 6 or 7 spread uh, around the base, even in the forest. So that is pretty good. In today's episode we'll work towards getting all the rocket fuel we're needing. Right now we have a very little amount flowing here. And we need to get about 1.6k to uh, supply our uh, rockets. So um, that is what we'll work towards in today's episode. So if you think that's a good idea, remember to leave a like on the video. And if you're new to the channel, remember to subscribe as well. And come follow me on Twitch, dgrade20 there. So you can join in on the live streams. We're having a blast there and it's always fun. So um, let's go to our little area. Um, so far, uh, what we need is uh, just to expand it out, let's see, maybe five or six times. This one gives us about 3 points, uh, 370 per minute. We need about 1.6. So if we do this times four or five, if we do this times five maybe, we'll have enough. Um, the thing is though, I don't think we have enough room for times five here. So that's something we'll have to work at doing. So let's see how much room do we have. One, two, three, four. Yeah, we can fit in four. So um, I think the best thing to do is uh, just having this and then doing another grid somewhere else. Then we'll overproduce a bit in terms of 2k. But uh, we'll have uh, enough capacity to go a bit buff 2k in the future. Let's grab all of you down to here and let's get the robots to deliver it all in. And there. That looks mighty fine. Go my minions. And while that is going, we can uh, kind of fix the outputs. I'll probably just do two on um, on each. So if we do something like this, you're going in that way. I think that'll be pretty good. We can also do it here instead. So right there. Then we'll do the same for the one over here. Just getting those two together. But in theory, do it here and get the other one that way there we are doing a nice quick expansion so that should give us what we need to uh, produce at least most of what we need I don't think anything is connected up wrong. We'll just check here at the top. We have fluid going in. We have that going around correctly. We have all the power we need. So we couldn't fairly take all of this and just place it down somewhere else. The second one, I'll probably place it uh, maybe down here. As we do have oil production, that also means light oil production down here. And that'll mean it hasn't has a shorter distance to travel. Well, let's just do this while we're here. Grab you. I'll be trained up names, but nothing else but that. And place one down. Maybe right here. Everything get in and out. Uh, seems so. There we are. Please build that my minions giving us um, quite a lot of throughput, to be honest. Our wise still holding strong. Are uh, maxing out our steam turbines once in a while, so uh, we might have to expand out our nuclear power as well. Yeah, let's just watch this in action before we do anything. Let's see. goes very very quickly that is hooked up power is increasing 
using almost 2 gigawatts just for beacons. As you can see, when we did the builds, they keep jumping up. Will we get to 2 gigawatts? Ooh. Yes, exactly 2 gigawatts of beacon power. Let's see if that hooks up correctly. That goes out. We do have enough trains to just waiting to load because we're not producing enough. That means you should be pretty much done and we can soon do a little test of the throughput on this one. And see what kind of numbers we can pull. Can this keep up? Seems so. We have enough to get it to the end, or will we have to? Well, that looks more than fine. Ooh, this one is maybe struggling a bit. It might be right on the edge of what we can uh, do as a throughput to this one. Yeah, because the top one is way, way more full, but that is because we probably have these uh, emptying out first. Is it going all the way through the end? Yeah, we seem we seem good in terms of getting uh, this to run. More trains going in. Ooh, probably need to expand out our trains a bit. Let's just solve that. Ooh, that's a bit of a bottleneck. At least trying to. There we are. And let's add in right here at our train depot. So we'll do one, two, three, four more. They'll get built. They will get light oil. And then we'll start uh, moving them out. There we are. So we can go to depot, depot. And this is such a nice way to expand out the base. Now that we can do it, just adding in the trains. You've seen it a few times before, and uh, they'll just kind of leave and pick up whatever we, we need. Luckily, we have quite a lot of light oil stored around the base, so so that is looking very, 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 very well. So, how are you looking? 1.4, almost 1.5, so we this is very, very close to uh, 2k science a minute. Consuming all the belts. One, two, one, two, three, four. Uh, yeah, we cannot. We can almost produce that. We have a small uh, negative. At least we should have. Oh, we have a net rate compared to what's being consumed. Everything should be good. All of it running. Oh, we might be taxing our system a bit in terms of getting enough light oil in. Yeah, a small amount might want to get a second train unloading. We have enough, so let's just set that up. I don't want us to be constrained by something like that, so what if we just do... You can go here, and then we'll hook up you to each of these. that that we'll do the same on the other one of course remove you there and there then we should get the light all in and this one we can copy to the new one we just placed in to make sure this has enough as well unload it you can drop that one and do that so hopefully this means that we'll have enough flowing in now, so we can get this flickering away. Uh, so that is uh, something there's no need to have happen in the base. Yes, and the rest is just missing rocket fuel, so that is looking mighty fine. So what else do we need to hook up? Mm, let's see. Let's see if this has been 
built so we can see it in action. It seems we are now having full lanes of light oil. Meaning that we have an output of rocket fuel at 2.4k per minute. That is 900 more than we need. The consumption is like this because that's how they get delivered to uh, the rockets. But that will slowly but surely change. So how are we looking at the rocket launch sites? Things are getting in. Still missing that. Getting double rocket launches here. And we have about 62,000 buffer of uh, white science. Now let's just get some of these removed uh, as I want to clear them out from our, uh, our little tree here. While we watch a few rocket launches. Let's get you away as well. All the way to infinite research. And you. And a few more. Yes, here goes all the rocket fuel in to our rocket silos. Giving us a nice amount of uh, <laughs> things out. One thing I have been debating is do we need to double the unloading? Because the trains can't deliver it fast enough for just one train. That is something I might do. But I uh, haven't decided yet so to comment because the trains hold such a small amount in terms of uh, what's in the train. Not the rocket, perfect. So that is looking pretty decent. While we're here, let's just expand out a bit down here, giving our robot something to do so we can easily hook up more. And now you'll see our new grid in action. Look how easy that is to do. God, it's so nice. Just being able to stamp things down and robots take care of it. Anything else I want to get in? We have some over here we might want to get. Yeah, and this is pretty much just how we can expand the base at the moment. Giving our robots a bit to do. And probably adding in some... Oh, 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 oh. Let's add in another nuclear as well. So right there. As already in uh, Fingos in the live stream, I set this up and ready to add in a new nuclear power plant or when the power needed it and that seems to be right now Jesus because we did activate <laughs> a lot of our base doing this so our minions will slowly fill it all in and uh, yeah that'll be quite good So I think this will be a pretty good place to end the episode. We, we got the, what we needed done this episode. We got our 1.5k rocket fuel. We actually had about 2.8 is probably what we have in throughput. We fixed the throughput issues and uh, we expanded out the base. So that will be uh, done for the next live stream where we will build on top of this. Or maybe for the next episode. So... Um, look forward to that and um, if you want to see more of this and chat with me live do remember to uh, follow me on twitch and uh, like the video here on youtube as well and subscribe to the channel to keep up to date with what's going to happen if you need any of the updated blueprints jump on discord i will share this blueprint book and any other thing that you might need as a, a service to you guys so, as I said, thank you so much for watching, guys. Uh, I've been D-Gray, and I will see you in the next episode. Bye.